Hi, this is Adas from I Can Canva and I want to show you how you can use your imagination to make beautiful combinations of photos and elements. I will go to photos and search for grapes. I will pick one photo that is in an upright position so it will look as realistic as possible as a skirt. I will use the effect and go to background remover to make it transparent. Once that's done, I will go to elements and search for a flamenco dancer. I can just type in flamenco and choose the dancer I like. I will pick this one. And now I will place the grapes in front of the flamenco dancer. I will go to position and click on forward. Now I will crop my dancer up to the hips so I can place my grapes without having her real skirt peeking out. On top of the grapes I have a green stem which I don't want so I will just easily crop it. Give it a little twist just to make it more realistic. Adjust its placing. And now as you can probably see the dancer's hand is behind the skirt and I want to make it appear in the front of the skirt. So I will just duplicate my dancer, place it exactly on top of the first one. I will go to crop and I will crop my dancer and leave just the palm of her hand. So what appears is that her hand is in front and the rest of her body is behind the grapes. See what it looks like once you crop it? You have only the bottom part of her hand. Now I would like to create the shadow. So I will duplicate my grapes. I will go to effects and choose do tone. Click on see all and take the darkest one I see, the mono that will turn my photo into black. Then I will go to adjust and play around with the brightness, the contrast, the saturation until my grapes will be completely blacked out. Then, the funnest part is, I will go to blur and I will blur my photo. Do notice, do not go all the way because when it's too blurred, it will not look that real. So we wanna go just a notch to, let's say 25. Then I will go to transparency and I will swipe it, let's say to 14, just to make it seem like a real shadows. I will go to position, click on backwards, and place it behind. Now I would like to add some flamenco shoes. So I remember I had in this exact result, just somewhere here, some flamenco shoes. I will pick them and I will place them Underneath the grapes, I will go to position and click on backwards. And there you go. There's your fruity flamenco dancer. And that's it. Hope you enjoy it. Bye.